Hello, and welcome to the lab. SuperChem VR is a proof of concept immersive virtual reality chemistry lab. It was developed for commercially available virtual reality systems that include headsets and hand controllers, like the HTC Vive and the Oculus Rift. Use the trigger with your index finger to grab objects. Teachers report that learning about chemicals, lab equipment, and how to use the equipment correctly can be a slow process. So SuperChem VR is designed to allow you to learn about these concepts in a safe, interactive, and immersive way. SuperChem VR allows you to recognize lab equipment and associate it with the appropriate tasks. If you don't know what to do, your lab assistant, ChemBot, provides prompts to guide you in the right direction. Place your flask in this analyzer to check. You need to perform actual measurements correctly to complete the task, which also gives you practice with lab skills. You can explore and learn safely without being intimidated by a real-life lab where things can break and resources run out. Please be careful. And because it's virtual reality, you remain safe, have access to all of the resources you need, and can try again. ChemBot reinforces proper lab conduct by providing information on standard lab practices. It might be easier to use a beaker to catch the liquid, so you can make small adjustments in the graduated cylinder. You can scan an object to hear ChemBot explain its purpose in greater detail. This is a beaker. Use it to hold and transfer liquids from the liquid dispenser. The weight boat can hold solids while they are measured on the balance. This combination of an immersive and engaging environment with scaffolding for exploring chemistry allows you to have fun while learning. Activating zero gravity mode. Yay. It glows. When you finish the reaction, how do you know how well you did? The substance analyzer calculates the percentage of the reaction that was completed correctly. Nice. Good job. The brightness of the glow serves as an indicator of how well you completed the steps. The brighter the glow, the more accurate you were. You also have digital lab notes that detail your steps, so you can review your margin of error to identify how to improve next time. In phase one, we were able to develop the core technology we need for lab basics. For phase two, we plan to put the experiment in the context of a real problem. The game narrative will place you in a broken down spaceship. You must solve problems to survive, such as lighting a dark hallway with a glow stick. The path to the cargo bay is dark and you will need a light source to travel there. Perform These real life reactions have a real life purpose that will be essential to win the game. You will have to scavenge for materials and make good use of what you find which is the analog to a lab that is only stocked with limited material, so wasting is discouraged. We are confident that letting players engage in realistic, scientifically accurate problem solving in a futuristic setting will bring excitement and relevance to learning chemistry. <laughs>